Today is Brick's seventh day birthday, so it's been a week, which is crazy since he's been born. I can't believe it. So, yeah, it's very exciting. I just can't believe we were in the hospital a week ago that he was born at Spring Valley. It's super crazy. He's super cute. He's getting more chunkier. Um, yesterday we got some really good news after we did our vlog. Um, we got a call from the pediatrician and he said his levels of jaundice have gone down. So yay. And he said we don't have to do any more checkups since he's going potty all the time and eating all the time. So he's basically flushing it out of his system. If he wasn't doing that, there would be a problem. But he's doing really, really good. So it's crazy. I still can't believe. Oh, and today's his actual due date. March 31st was his due date, so um, it's so crazy. I do miss having him in my belly because he's with me and my tummy kicking and stuff, but it's really exciting to have him out and to see, watch him grow and get bigger and stronger. And My mom actually measured him today. I think he's 21 inches now, so he gained an inch. Yeah, so we're super excited. And today, well, last night, it was kind of a long night. I noticed he likes to be close to me or Michael, which I'm not surprised because he was always cuddling um, down by my placenta and he loved to squish my bladder where I had to go potty all the time. <laughs> so, um, <clears throat> so at nighttime, he likes to be coddled a little bit more. So me or Michael have to hold him or I rock him a lot more. So I don't get a lot of sleep at nighttime. <laughs> And if I do put him in his bassinet, I actually have to hold his hand next to our bed until he falls asleep. Because if I don't, he wakes up and starts crying and because he, he always needs someone close. My mom even noticed that today because she came and picked us up. Because um, came and picked us up so I can go do some fun laundry. <laughs> Non-stop laundry. And uh, she noticed how he does not like to be by himself. Because <laughs> we had him in the back seat. And um, we were driving over just two minutes away. And he was crying. And it made me really, like, stressed out. Like, oh, my gosh, is he okay? Is he okay? Is he okay? But he was good. He just likes to be near people. He likes to be touched and coddled all the time. So, yeah, it's super cute. It's kind of hard at night because, I have, like I said, I have to hold his hand till he falls asleep. Cause he just needs that touch. He just loves that touch, which is really cute. So, what did you think about him making his first attempt last night at crawling? Awesome. That that surprised me. Six days in, he was already trying to crawl, and he did have success. Yeah, he was laying on your belly. He was laying on Michael's belly, belly to belly, and he kept pushing his little booty up, trying to crawl. It was so funny, super cute. Yeah, he pushed his legs. He pushed his butt up. And then he dug his legs into my stomach and he did a huge uh, push, basically. And uh, he had success. He pushed himself all the way up to my chin. And then um, also you heard him laugh for the first time last night. <laughs> I did. I heard him do little giggles. I was like, oh my goodness. Um, I was looking at him because he kind of did a little squirmy just to make sure he's okay. And he was smiling so big and started giggling. I was like, I did not know a uh, six days old. Some, a little baby could do that. I was, it was so cute, but I couldn't wake up Michael. He wasn't, he was totally out, so. <laughs> but it was super cute. Um, so yeah, he had his first laugh at six days old. It was so cute. Let's see. He looks like he's just lights out right now. Did you just feed him or? Yeah, we just fed him, so. But he sleeps good during the day. He's like an awesome. Maybe that's when I should sleep, <laughs> but he is amazing. He sleeps really good during the day, um, but at night he's a little more skirmish. I think he just likes to be near us, so. But he was like that too when I work. He'd be up during the day, and then I work at night, so he'd be up all night with me. So kicking, swimming, moving around, having a lot of fun, so. And last night, Brick and I had a very good band practice. Uh, I think we're starting to finally solidify this new show, at least moving in that direction. And I will <clears throat> make an announcement right now. I have written a song for Brick, an original tune, if you will. And uh, I think it's a pretty good one, so uh, stay tuned for that. I'm not sure when I'll have a chance to actually uh, record the parts, but, uh, but I'm very proud of that song. I'm excited to share it. It's from the father perspective from me to him. Yeah, so you've heard it. What do you think of the song? 
I love it. It brings tears to my eyes every time. It's very, it's a really good, really good song. It's so cute. And it's about our son. I mean, how does it not make me emotional? <laughs> so, you're an amazing songwriter, like always. So. Well, thank you. That's very kind. Now, we have, uh, don't we have a visitor coming over today? Yes, we do. Your dad and um, Lolita are coming over today. They're going to see Brick. They haven't seen him since he was born. It was pretty crazy that night, a week ago, basically. <laughs> Everybody came in and saw him, but I was uh, doing my best to uh, breastfeed him and doing skin to skin when everybody came in to see when he was born. So everybody's, so yeah, your mom, no, sorry, your dad and Lily are coming this evening around five to see their cute first grandbaby. They're super excited. We kept it going, kept the Darby name going in the live. <laughs> It's a miracle. <laughs> On my side, this is, he's number, he's, he's number eight. So the, we're, our family's doing pretty good, but the Darbys, this is their first, so they're all super excited. I remember when my mom had her first grandbaby, Chase, so she was super excited, so was my dad. Always wanted to come over and hold the baby. So you guys have eight grandbabies on your side, and then we, this is our first, obviously. Yeah, that's correct, yeah. So there's eight on um, my side, and then this is your side, the first, which will probably be, you be spoiled a lot. <laughs> you always want to be number one. Didn't you enjoy being number one? You're number one. Um, I, I never was really number one until I got out of college. <laughs> no, no, yeah. No, I was, I started to excel in college, but before that, I was always, I didn't make that, that top mark just quite yet. With the grandparents, you had a good relationship with your 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 grandma, your mom's mom. Oh, I guess she did. Yeah, she told me. I think she told me I was the favorite. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. And today he's wearing a really cute outfit. Since our theme for his crib and room is whales, um, my aunt Barbie she got me us another whale outfit. It's cute little shorts. It's a little bit warmer today. It was chilly today. I had a cute little. Nice warm outfit, sweaters, uh, pants on him, but of course he went potty on them, so we had to change him twice because he went potty on two outfits. But this one he's staying clean, so that's really good. And then it's so funny because he's wearing socks too, and it's six to nine months socks. So as you can see uh, from me saying that, he has pretty big feet, so he's going to have his daddy's feet. <laughs> he has my feet and my fingers, and that's about it, I think. No, he has your eyes. He looks a lot like you. The first thing that's like I always said when he came out, I'm like, oh my gosh, he looks just like Michael. But yeah, so today I went to my mom's. We had a good visit. We She got me food, and she cuddled Brick the whole time, fed him, just loved on him, because that's what she loves to do is hold babies while I was uh, doing lots of laundry. I'm not even done yet. <laughs> and then I tried to clean up the, the yard around these parts, and uh, I had a little bit of success, at least mowing the lawns, I had some success doing that. But then, of course, it's windy and it starts raining again, so I thought, oh, well, I'm just gonna wait to rake up stuff. And so I got to come in and visit again with Brick, and then you were kind enough to make me some pasta, which was very tasty, thank you for that. Yeah, it made you pasta, even though I was super tired. <laughs> you gotta take care of your boys, so. Make sure they got their food. And then I took a quick shower, really quick, because I knew you, you and my mom were out there. So I was like, I'm gonna take a quick shower super fast so I can smell someone decent when your dad comes over. <laughs> I mean, having a baby, you know, a lot of you know, first time, it's pretty hectic and busy trying to figure out the schedule and what you should do, when you should do it. That's what I'm still learning. When you should do this, when you should do that when you should pump, when she should clean, when she should sleep, when she should eat, or maybe you don't eat because you're taking care of the baby. So, but that's why I have Michael. He's been making sure I eat too. He makes me a lot of sandwiches. Heavy on the spinach. Heavy on the spinach, USDA. USDA. <laughs> USDA. So I can make good breast milk for a uh, brick right here. If you guys are wondering why the image on the camera is getting brighter and then softer, and then brighter and softer. It's because of the storm. You know, we're using sunlight right now, so the sun just, the clouds are coming in and out. So that's why it's getting brighter. He doesn't, it's not from the blanket. He doesn't glow like E.T. just quite yet. <laughs> yeah, he's on the blanket right now, but he will be pretty soon. And listening to scales, which will help me get better too, because I've been off for 
nine months practicing basically because I was sick the first trimester and the second one was pretty good but then the third one just went back to I can't even get off the floor unless Michael helped me so <laughs> but um yeah so we're both me and Brick are both doing our skills and we need to be to get ready to perform again I'm super excited yeah, we do have a show coming up uh, do you remember what elementary school it's at I believe it's Cunningham Elementary School in the Clark County School District. We've been taking a break just because uh, obviously there's a lot of moving parts when you're bringing a child into the world. But now we're trying to get back on track, so we've been rehearsing, and uh, and of course uh, we're trying to help Brick excel his music ability. So pretty soon we're gonna be on stage, and hopefully it goes well because <laughs> <laughs> we've been busy. I'm trying to get those practices in. Yeah, and also Brick has matching overalls, so he'll have them. Um, he'll be dressed up just like we are for every show, but we'll make sure he has headphones, so because you know their hearing is so sensitive. But um, yeah, I'm excited. He's gonna matching overalls, and we are gonna do a family photo with us all in matching overalls, so you guys will see that. It'll be super cute. I'm excited, and Alice will be in it too, our dog. So. Do you think we could find overalls for Alice? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I don't know. They have a lot of different stuff for dogs. <laughs> a lot of dress up costumes for them. I wouldn't be surprised if we did. Try to find maybe, maybe one of the mother <laughs> units can uh, try to crack that code. Yeah. Yeah. I was just seeing put a bandana around her neck. A pink one since she's a girl. Because we're even right now. Two boys, two girls. Because I got Alice. She's a girl. So. <laughs> but. Brick's doing really good. Everything's going good. But thank you guys for listening on Brick's seventh day birthday. I can't believe he's a week old. Thank you for your comments. We really appreciate it. And we will talk to you guys again soon. Remember, no matter how different we may be from each other, if we treat each other with respect, we can always be friends. Keep that in your mind. Keep that in your heart. And we'll see you tomorrow, friends. <laughs>